Hello everyone! Well, I am so sorry for my look right now. I was not planning on filming this video this way at all. I was planning on like getting glammed and do a nice video about it. I was actually writing the notes on my phone and then I was like, you need to film the video now. I think it makes sense to film it now as you're writing it because now you have everything clear in your mind and it makes sense, right? So, um, many of you know already because obviously you've read the title of the video, but I have decided to quit my prep. This show that I'm doing on Sunday, the Two Bros show, will be the last show of my season. Um, I have to say that obviously I don't think I'm 100% ready for this show because the standard is super high. Like the girls that compete in my class are freaking amazing. So regardless of the outcome of what is going to happen, I'm just going to go there and enjoy the day. Do my whole glam up and stuff, which is the part that I like the most about this. And yeah, just have fun. Uh, but yes, this is going to be the last show of the season. I was going to compete in October again. But in my last show, it came clear to me that I was not going to be ready in October to step on a stage against those girls again. And this is mainly because I realized how widespread the use of help is in this sport. I've heard rumors about it but never knew this was actually the thing that was happening. Uh, even talking to some friends uh, that I met last year in my competitive season, I realized that they had taken the help as well. Um, and it actually made me realize that, oh my god, like, yeah. There is no way doing things naturally I would be ready in October because the amount of muscle mass that I need to gain and the level of threats that these girls get to, I'm not going to be able to do it with this little nothing that I have. That's just not going to happen. So together with my coaches, we've decided that the best thing for me is to go straight into an off-season right after my two brush show this Saturday, uh, mainly because I've already been in a deficit for a year, which is not going to allow me to gain any muscle mass uh, or to improve my physique really very much um, without using these things. Um, I'm not against them, you know. I think like everybody is free to do with their body whatever they want to but me personally I don't want to use them so in order to be able to be competitive and be able to compete against girls that use these things I will need at least one maybe two years off where I concentrate on eating and freaking smashing every single gym session, getting my weights up and building some muscle. So this is mainly the reason why I decided to stop competing. It makes me... <sighs> makes me really sad. For a few reasons. Um, first and foremost, mainly because of my sponsor and everybody that supports me. I just feel like I'm failing a little bit, deciding not to do the competitions in October. <sighs> but also because realizing how much the use of this help is spreading the sport is just like wow literally like what I had in my mind that you could achieve um it's literally not it's not true you know if you want to do this naturally you need a long time like a proper proper off season So yeah, after my second show, I was a bit down because coming up to this realization just, you know, put many things into perspective 
um, I was literally almost deciding to not even do this show on Saturday but I decided yeah I'm just gonna finish my season with another federation and see what happens I'm not expecting anything because as I said the standard is super high um, but I'm gonna have fun and I'm gonna enjoy it Another thing that I've realized is that I think myself right now, having tried different federations and different styles of posing, I think that what I am more drawn to is more the fitness model category. So more federations like WBFF and things like that, that they take into account uh, more things and where your poses are more free and more fun because I love being on stage, right? But sometimes when you need to do like certain specific poses and you can not like play around more, um, it's not as fun, you know? And I just love being on the stage and just do different poses and have fun. So yeah, I think whatever I do next is going to be more into the modeling, the fitness model categories or definitely for sure natural bodybuilding federations where I know that I will be competing against people that have built their physiques in a natural way and where you get tested and things like that to see more um you know if I can actually you know make it you know because sometimes when you're doing it naturally but you're compared to, to girls that are not natural then you don't know if it's actually you know you didn't put enough work in the prep or is it because, you know, they have taken some help and obviously it's better. So yeah, definitely into the natural bodybuilding uh, federations to see if, it, if I actually deserve to place and to be top three, top two, top one. Uh, and of course, um, fitness model, so WBFF style. Well, I'm gonna finish the video here. Um, I will keep posting things because as I said, I'm going into off season, so I'm gonna keep working out. I'm gonna change the way I eat as well. I'm gonna start um, raising my calories. Uh, sorry for the crazy kids outside of my house, but yeah, they're crazy, so yeah. And uh, yeah, I will keep posting things. Please let me know what you think in the comments. Um, and yes, please let me know what kind of things do you want to see now that I'm going to stop competing for a while.